So for years, I resisted upgrading my laptop. It was incredibly slow. My upgrade, light, fast, reliable. I feel like an idiot for not upgrading sooner. Now, gents, let's take that analogy and apply it to your summer style. Seriously, gents, a lot of you guys have summer pieces that are out of fashion. In today's video, gents, I'm going to talk about specific pieces, how you can replace them so that you can easily upgrade your summer wardrobe. First up on the list, gents, upgrade your white t-shirt. Now, nothing against the white t-shirt. If you've got one that fits you well, isn't stained, looks great on you, sure, wear it. But guys, I'm talking about expanding past the white t-shirt. The first two upgrades are the Henley and the Polo. So, the Polo shirt you've probably seen before comes off the Polo fields. This is a collared shirt that's usually short sleeve, although you do see long sleeve, oftentimes made from a peak cotton. Now, I do recommend that you look for something made from Jersey. Jersey is going to be a lighter weave, something's going to be more breathable. Peak is great and it's also made for sports, so made to absorb sweat. But the issue with peak cotton is it can be a bit thick and it can sometimes not be very breathable. So, I really like Jersey because this is going to be something that's going to allow air to flow in and something that's going to feel great in hot weather. Now, the Henley is basically a polo shirt without the collar. And a lot of guys like this because it just seems casual. At the same time, when you look at it, what does it do? It draws her eyes to the chest. Two to three buttons right there in the front. So, it doesn't go too far down, but it is something that just looks good. There's something about the Henley that makes it look a bit more rugged at the same time, a little bit dressier than a regular t-shirt. I personally love them and I think if you've got the body for it, which to me you need to have a decent or a thin build, heavier set guys, I would lean towards the next option. The other option, a lightweight casual button down, preferably with long sleeves that you can easily roll up. Now, why do you want to go for this if you're a thinner guy, if you're a heavier set guy? Because it's going to better balance the upper part of your body, your torso. It just looks better than going with a t-shirt. You can do it, but I'm going to say that this in general is going to look better on you. Tons of options out there. And when I say casual, I'm not talking about a dress shirt. Going, you don't have to go straight white, although that is an option I think looks great. But I do like small repeating patterns. You can go with a solid, maybe in a light blue, maybe even a pink. Find something that works for you that works with your colors. But when you go with a shirt like this, it's actually incredibly versatile. You can actually match it with a wide range of different trousers. And again, this is going to look so much better than just a simple white t-shirt. The next item we're going to be replacing, that worn out cotton hoodie that you just can't let go of. Now, gents, I get it. You love that sweatshirt. It's kept you warm out on your boat, those cool nights when you're hanging out on the beach. But come on, guys, that sweatshirt has seen better days and you graduated a decade ago. Gents, you need to upgrade to a cashmere wool pullover. Now, guys, I have to be honest, this amazing pullover, I did not find it myself. I worked with today's sponsor, Stitch Fix. If you haven't heard of Stitch Fix, you are in for a treat. These guys make it so simple for you to upgrade your summer wardrobe. Yeah, you don't have to go into stores. Instead, you go over to their website, you fill out this extensive profile that you give them all the information they need to be able to go in and select items to upgrade and improve your wardrobe. Gents, this is how it works. First, you're going to go over to stitchfix.com slash RMR style. You fill out a style profile and then a Stitch Fix expert stylist will hand select five items just for you based on your preferred fit, budget and lifestyle. Next, you receive your package right at your home, try on everything, keep what you want and return what you don't. And gents, returns are super easy. You can just use the prepaid envelope that comes in the package they ship to you. So, all that being said, what do I really think of the service? The answer is they sent me really good items and I did love four out of the five. One out of the five, not so much. I'm going to probably return it. It just wasn't my style, but I will wear it at the end of this video and you can let me know down in the comments if I should keep it. But no, the bird's eye pullover, amazing. And then what the cool part there is I normally would never have chosen something like that for myself. So, it exposed me to something new. Gents, it's a great service. They've got a wide range of items. So, if you're looking for shoes, if you're looking for intimates, if you're looking for professional wear, they've got you covered. Oh, and it's not a subscription service. You get to choose when you want to receive these items. You can choose to receive it once a month or you can say, you know what? I don't want anything right now. Now, they do have a styling fee, but when you use that link down there in the description, guys, you're going to get that styling fee waived. So, make sure to use that link. Go check out Stitch Fix. Absolutely love this company. They're making it so easy to upgrade your style wardrobe this summer. Now, let's talk about your cargo shorts. Yeah, the ones in camouflage, gents, we're going to let them go, at least put them to the back of the closet and let's upgrade your shorts. So, first up, let's drop the cargo pocket. I know it has saved lives, but for this summer, gentlemen, let's see if we can find some shorts that have about a nine inch inseam and do not have a cargo pocket. Now, gents, don't cry over the pocket because we're going to have fun. Yeah, you can go with shorts in gray, you can go with tans, you can go with browns, you can even go with navy, but why not have fun with the color of your shorts? 
parts of the summer. Look at orange, look at brighter blue, tons of great options out there. And what I love about oranges, it's a variation actually of tan and it's going to go with pretty much all of your white and blue shirts. Next on our summer upgrade list, let's talk denim. Now, gents, I love jeans, but jeans are not the perfect trousers for hot weather because yeah, they get heavy, they're not very breathable and when you start to sweat in jeans, it just sticks next to your body. Yeah, that does not feel good. So, what are your options? One, you could actually dress it up, go with tropical weight wool trousers. Look for them, they're out there. These are going to be made oftentimes from a weave and a fabric that's going to allow the air to go in and out. At the same time, they're not going to be transparent, so you're still going to look good and they are really going to dress things up. But if you want to keep it more casual and you want something that's going to be less expensive, easier to find, look for chinos. So, what's the difference between chinos and khakis? Khakis are going to be a type of trouser that are going to be more loose fitted. They're oftentimes going to have pleats in them. Chinos are going to be flat fronts and with chinos, we're also going to see a wide variety of colors. Yes, you'll see tans, you'll see browns, but you're also going to see them in brighter colors. Reds, we're going to see bright blues, a wide variety of different colors. So, chinos, you can have fun, you can bring in greens. What I really like about chinos is oftentimes you can get these slimmed up, you can even get them hemmed so they're a little bit shorter and why have that shorter hem? So, you allow the air to go in and around the leg and to be able to show off your shoes. Now, speaking of summer shoes, these are not the type of shoes that you want to be showing off. These are fine for running, but they are not fine for wearing day to day. Now, what about canvas sneakers? Well, they're better than running shoes, but still, these aren't shoes that are really going to get you compliments. They're fun, they're comfortable, but they're not something that's going to help you stand out from the crowd. Gents, your shoes are the foundation of your wardrobe. Invest in a nice, simple, clean pair. Right here, this isn't going to win any awards, but this is a classic penny loafer style in a brown that's going to match pretty much all of your shorts and this is going to look so much better than any of the previous shoes I just showed you. Now, Antonio, I want something breathable. I want something lightweight. Well, guess what? You've got options. You just have to look around. Right here, we've got a perforated leather. This is going to be cooler than any type of canvas sneaker, any type of running shoe and the weight right here, it's almost nothing. This is a really nice, simple shoe. If you look around, you can find these. You want a little bit more flash? You want to spend a little bit more money? Definitely look Italian. The Italians have got it down when it comes to great looking, stylish, hot weather footwear. Speaking of hot weather, whew, let's upgrade your smell. Now, gents, you know you don't want to smell bad, but why not smell good? And there are tons of great cheap fragrances out there that actually smell really nice. That being said, if you want to spend a little bit more money, tons of options out there. What I like about these aquatic fragrances is that they smell of the Mediterranean, they smell of the ocean and really they just work perfect for summer. If you don't like aquatics, you don't want to smell like the ocean, then look to citrus scents. What I like about these, fresh, clean. If you like bergamot, you like lemon, you like lime, you like grapefruit, tons of options. The only issue with the most citrus scents is that they don't last too long. However, there are exceptions. This citrus for many people lasts almost all day, although not everyone really likes the sour note. Next, let's upgrade the baseball cap. Now, this hat right here has sentimental value. I picked it up in Hawaii when I was with my kids. They were learning to surf. We had a great time, but uh, I just needed something to keep the sun out of my eyes. Guys, if you know that you're going to need a hat to keep the sun out of your eyes, then why not get a style stylish hat that is specifically designed to do just that. Now, when you show this hat to a lot of guys, they're going to say, you know what? That's a little bit too much for me. I'll continue to wear my baseball cap. Here's the thing is you're used to wearing a cap. You're wearing that baseball cap. You're just not used to a hat that has such a pronounced crown and brim. Brim is how far this thing goes out, about two inches and the crown is how high it goes up. So, look for a hat that actually isn't going to be as pronounced. Now, this hat right here, as you can see, the crown and the brim are not as pronounced, not as large, not as long and therefore, this hat is going to be a lot easier to wear. This is actually my go-to hat when I'm traveling. I also like the functionality. I can fold this hat up, it returns to its original shape. Guys, find something that works for you, practice wearing it and all of a sudden, you're going to be able to pull off this look. Next up, gents, upgrade the shades. In particular, pay attention to the lenses. So, when you buy those cheap, yes, $10, $15 sunglasses, you throw them around, they get all scratched up, but most importantly, those lenses, guys, are not good quality. So, invest in good sunglasses that actually do a great job of filtering and protecting your eyes from those dangerous UV rays. Now, aviators, everyone's got a pair of aviators and if you've got a great pair, good on you. But guys, maybe look to a different style. Wayfarer, going to draw a lot more attention. My favorite though, the Clubmaster. What I like about the Clubmaster, it's got the Wayfarer basically attention grabbing right up here. It stands out from the crowd. When you wear these, they're just something different about them and I love the way that these work with my face but find a pair that's going to be just a bit stronger. Wayfarers are awesome, Clubmasters are great but maybe change up the style. 
All right, Jen, so as promised, here's the one item I felt that really wasn't my style. The repeating pattern, I like the fabric of the polo, just the pattern for me just did not work. That being said, the other four items they sent me, I absolutely love. And what I love about Stitch Fix is they introduced me to an item, this hoodie right here, I never would have picked out for myself. Now I'm absolutely loving, especially here in Wisconsin, it gets cooler in the evenings, even during the summer. This thing, cashmere wool, is absolutely beautiful. So again, guys, you want a painless summer upgrade? Check out Stitch Fix. I'm linking to them down in the description. Use that link, gents, stitchfix.com slash rmrstyle and get your styling fee waived on your first fix from Stitch Fix. Next up, gents, let's upgrade your watch. Oh, you're not wearing a watch or you're wearing an Apple watch? Come on, let's upgrade. Let's go up to the real thing, guys. I'm talking about dive watches, dive watches with a rubber strap, dive watches with a metal strap. More about watches, you like watches? Check out this video right here where I go into all the summer essentials and I do go into a lot of different watches, have a lot of fun with this video. So go check it out, guys. If you're looking to upgrade your summer wardrobe and you wanna continue on with this video, go check out this video right here where I go into a lot more.